click the subscribe button, hit the bell icon to never miss another update. Please stop. The way you eat I don't think you will be able to regain your energy. You do your job and I will do mine. Hmm. Okay. Fast, fast, carefully. You are pulling it very softly. You need someone who can do it better. I have a slave, not one but three slaves. Look, you have wasted your money. You are enslaving like these. I see no difference between him and my slaves. You'll see now. I am a buyer. I am a buyer. Huh? I'll buy in 20 dinars. I'll buy in 25. I am a buyer. I am a buyer. I'll pay 30 dinars. Listen carefully to what I am saying. You are responsible for everything that needs force and power. If the work is not done properly, then there will be no sign of food. If you do a good job, you will find that you have found a good owner. Okay. I just said 30 coins and no more. Let's go. Where are you going? Where are you going? Stop. Stop. You have given me your words. Counting coins is also a difficult task. Who would be like me to sell only for 30 dinars? You should know your worth. I will give you money in return. I'm tired of it. Now come up with something new. Get lost. This money was for household expenses, not for you. You should be ashamed. We don't need it anymore. Keep it to yourself. Are you misbehaving with me? This coin. Coin? You yourself said, you are tired. Hello brother. Nice room. Come in and see. We are not here to buy things. Means no customers today. Don't be in a hurry, be patient. Coincidentally, there is a customer today. There are 30 coins in this. If you protect them till tomorrow, then 5 coins are yours. We are traders like you, and our job is to buy and sell. We are strangers in this city, we have come to get the goods. Going out of town today for a job. You know well that it is not right to take this money with us. Bandits are all over the place. If you do not agree, we can go to someone else. Maybe I made a mistake. Let's go. No, no, why not? What about our hospitality? Take this and count them. That's right, 30 gold coins. We may leave now. And yes, give us the money only when we are together. Alright, sure. How many coins will I have? What did you say? Five coins. Hope you are not tired. Whenever I am weak, I will do the same thing. Weak. <laughs> Help me please. Take it. 
<laughs> Sleep, do you have the strength to run or not? No need to run away. We'll go and take it back with honor and respect. What if he doesn't pay tomorrow? He will give it. He will stay in the room for five coins. I am not alone. I have a beggar. A beggar? Help me. Help me I am poor. Ah! You do not have anything to do so you are teasing me like this? This is the job today. I don't give money to anyone for free. Let's go. For your coins, behave like a camel seller. Let's go. Hello brother, work is done. Hello, found something to buy. Yes, just came after finalization. Where is your other partner? I told you that we are traders. We buy goods from one place and sell them in another. Yesterday I took a camel from this man. You told me I shouldn't pay until you both come together. I'm telling you that this man owns a camel. Give him the money so we can leave. My partner is waiting on the way. Have you sold camels to this man? Tell him, don't you want to take money for the camels? Yes, yes. He is not saying anything, brother. No, no. He sold the camels that's why he is here. There, five coins. Count them. <laughs> Yes, that's fine. Now it's your turn to get up. What should I do? What to do? Go and get the coins. But how? Go tell him that I have come to get my coins. But you took the coins already. Yes, but do you remember the condition? If he do not give it back? There is a judge in the city. The matter will go to the judge, and he will decide in our favor. What are you saying? He sent me to take the coins himself. He came with the camel owner. He said, you are with the camels. You are lying. Do we look like camel buyers, who buy and sell camels? But yesterday he was here with the camel seller. What happened to you? If you could not be able to keep them, then why did you take our money? That was our total capital. We are strangers in this city. But we will not let you steal our money. We will go to court. You did it in good faith. What good faith lady? They said keep 30 dinars with you. And they will give me 5 dinars for this work. Those five coins did their job. You paid for the household. Will you keep quiet or not, woman? Leave it. Let's see what I can do. They came to me and gave me coins. I knew they were liars. Which lie? They themselves sent me for coins. How could they go so far for coins? How can they be in two places simultaneously? But he was here yesterday morning. Is there a witness? No, it was only the camel man, but I don't know where he will be right now. Help me. Give them the coins or... How can I convince you that I have given the coins to his partner? Miser person. Is there a witness? As far as I know, 
You should give 30 coins as you are a rich businessman. Salamun alaykum. Not having a witness and being a rich businessman is not the reason for him to give 30 coins. His wife has told me the whole story. What was the condition? The condition was that the two be together while taking coins. Your partner is not visible. Even if he is here, nothing will be different. This man doesn't want to pay back. I know him. Money may be dearer to him than his family, but he cannot betray your trust. What could be more treacherous than one participant came in taking all money? I will give you the money but on your own term. Bring your other partner, then we will know this person is a good custodian or not. I have got the point, Imam Ali is right. What is this, how can you be a judge? Before you said this man should give money, and now you are saying this. Do you obey everyone? What is the matter? How many judges will there be? I will say he is lying and you will agree. That's what he said. His partner came and took the money. You were saying, he is not in this city? They were deceiving me. Catch him. You are the one who were deceiving me, I will kill you. Hold on, oh man. You are also guilty in this case. Those who do not fulfill the conditions of trust. May God reward you, O Ali. This man's greed showed us this day. Don't start again, lady. Gree always leads a person to a bad end. And for you, judgment is more suitable for prophets and imams. The judge should always place himself in the presence of God and place himself for the person he is issuing orders for. Come quickly, hurry. What happened? No wonder what happened. I am amazed how people here make someone else a judge when Imam Ali is among them. Let's go.